Great. Um, Secretary Duncan <coughs> spoke with Paul Whelan yesterday. Uh, what prompted that phone call, and is there a new offer put up by the United States to secure his release? What can you yeah. tell us? So I, and you talked to Secretary Blinken. So I would obviously refer you to the State Department to, to get more on that particular conversation. Uh, look, we have been very clear. We are always, always uh, clear about believing and, and working very hard to make sure that Paul Whelan and also Evan get, come home. Uh, and we do everything that we can. We're having those conversations to make sure that happen. I wish today, I, as I'm standing in front of you, I can say that there's a deal uh, and that we've made progress on that. I just don't have anything to share. Uh, but, uh, uh, but we want to see Paul Whelan come home to his family and his friends, and we want to see Evan come home. Uh, and uh, don't have anything to share on any deal or any uh, further discussion, but obviously we have been very, very clear about that. No deal, but can you say that there's been another offer? I, I just don't have anything to share about another offer. As, as you know, in the past we have put uh, forth offers uh, that has not been taken seriously uh, by, by the Russians, uh, and we're going to continue to do, do everything that we can to get them home uh, to, their friend, to their families and loved ones. Uh, Jake talked about speaking with Secretary Austin uh, yesterday. Has the President had a chance to talk to him? Yes, I can confirm that yesterday the President spoke to Secretary Austin, uh, and obviously he continues uh, uh, to wish him a speedy recovery and is looking forward to uh, the Secretary uh, going back to the Pentagon. Obviously the Secretary is still working, is working from home, uh, but he's uh, looking forward for the Secretary to get back to the Pentagon. The President took time to call Congressman-elect Swazi last night. Any chance he talked to the Homeland Security Secretary about his impeachment? Yeah, I think I said that Did at the top. Say, yes, I, I did. Forgive That's me. okay. That's all right. I was just <laughs> Um, <laughs> the candy gummy bird, the hard candy gummy bird. And just real quick, we, we asked Jake about this earlier. It yeah. seems to have really kicked up a hornet's nest. If there's anything more to know later about this alleged serious national security threat, uh, it would, would all just love to be you know, briefed or informed in whatever way you guys can. I, I, and the timetable on his meeting, for example, moves up to today or something. I understand. And, and, and Jake should <laughs> say he, at this time he's not in a position to speak about this. Uh, I'm going to leave that to our national security advisor. Uh, obviously, it is in his lane, very much in his lane, but I will make sure that I pass that along. Um, but yes, just to answer your first question, as I did moments ago, uh, the President did call Secretary Mayorkas earlier today, and they had a conversation. I'm not going to get into their private conversation, but they did connect.